if you are writing class 12th exam this year you would be a pretty busy person at this moment and through this video i would like to help you by giving you a snapshot of all exams you can take immediately after your class 12th examination if you are not aiming for a career in engineering or not aiming for a career in medicine so stay with me if you are a class 12th students we are going to talk about all important exams that you can take after class 12th but before i start let me tell you that pathfinder offers fantastic courses to prepare for ipm and hsw exams if you want to know about the syllabus of ipm exam for year 2022 or 2023 you can download the syllabus from the link provided in the description box our courses include live classes video lectures gk lectures practice tests mock tests pdf books and sheets doubt classes mentorship and everything that you need to succeed in these examinations feel free to inquire with us on 9343921347 so what is this video all about in this video i am not going to talk about anything except the name of the exam and if there is a date available for the conduct of that exam for this year i will just be speaking out the date of that exam probably a couple of sentences on which important courses you can take admission to through a particular exam let us get started basically if you are not aspiring for engineering or medicine and if you are looking for other competitive exams the first on the list is management programs so anybody aspiring for management programs should look at the ipmat exam ipmat exam is for entrance to the ipm programs offered by five iams i am indore i am rohtak i am jammu i am bodh gaya and i am rachi uh, you never know more iams can pitch in any time so there are three ipmat exams currently one conducted by iam indore which is going to be held on 2nd of july the other one conducted by iam rohtak which is going to be conducted on 26th of june and the third one <coughs> conducted by the national testing agency uh for which the date is not been released for all those people who are aspiring to apply for i am indore ipm program the link for uh, registration will be open soon in the next 7 to 10 days today is 31st of march in 7 to 10 days the link will be active on the website for you to register and apply for the course till then relax and have patience another set of management programs are offered by non iams so the first exam that comes to my mind is the npat the narsi manji uh, aptitude test which is going to be conducted from 1st of april to 26th of june this year so they have a window of around 2 months for you to apply in fact 3 months for you to apply to that the programs ug programs offered by narsi manji and there are programs in economics uh, programs in management programs in finance and so on then you have symbiosis entrance test which is going to be conducted on 26th of june again the admissions is primarily to the management programs and the media programs which is uh, you know which are offered through the act then duet is the exam that is conducted by the national testing agency for admissions to several courses offered by delhi university and you know you you should you should be looking to take this exam also very prestigious exam and admission also offered to prestigious institutes then you have zavier entrance test conducted by st zaviers mumbai and they offer you admission to two courses through zavier entrance test one is the bms program and the other is ba economics program next we have exams related to social sciences and social sciences liberal arts these are courses which are getting gaining in popularity year by year one of the best courses that you can apply for is 
the one offered by IIT Madras and the entrance exam for the course offered by IIT Madras in fact it is an integrated master of arts course that is being offered by IIT Madras and the entrance exam for that is HSEE so humanities and social science entrance exam this will be conducted on 12th of June this year 2022 the date has already been announced the registrations are open at this moment <coughs> you can also apply for the university entrance test conducted by uh, BHU Bana Banaras Hindu University in fact the NTA national testing agency is the body which will conduct UET for BHU BHU is one of the oldest central universities in India and one of the most renowned universities in India and anybody who wants to take admission to several courses offered by UAT, uh, by, by BHU from commerce to arts to economics to design to fine arts you have to appear for UET conducted by Banaras Hindu University this exam is likely to be conducted this year in July the registrations are yet to open and then you have EFLU EFLU is English and Foreign Languages University which is uh, originally which was based in Hyderabad right now there are three centers uh, Hyderabad Shillong and Lucknow so for entrance to courses on languages that is English language and several other foreign languages like French and Spanish you can apply to the EFLU great career options exist after courses that you can do from the English and Foreign Languages University. Next we have design and fine art related courses. So the first exam is NID that is National Institute of Design. It conducts a design aptitude test every year in January. So obviously for this year the exam has already been conducted. So anybody thinking of design as a career, NIDs are the premier institutes in India for a career in design. They offer UG as well as PG courses to design. National Institute of Foreign uh, Fashion Technology. You have courses by FDDI. There is an entrance test for FDDI as well. Footwear Design and Development Institute. And you have Symbiosis Entrance Exam for Design. So these are some of the major examinations for entrance to courses on design. In addition, you can find out individual departments of fine arts in various universities. Uh, for example, JJ Institute of Fine Arts in Mumbai or the MS University in Vadodara or the PHU Fine Arts Department. They are all doing an excellent job of training students on related courses. And finally, we have the CUCET. It is the Central University's Common Entrance Exam or Common Entrance Test for admission to a variety of courses conducted by the central universities. There are 12 central universities and anybody who is not aware, central universities are one of the most reputed universities in India offering different courses. So courses can range from sciences to humanities to arts, all kinds of courses are offered for which the common entrance exam is CU, CET. With this we come to an end of today's session. And we talked about several important exams that you could take after your class 12th exam is over. And since the dates are already announced for some of them, you can start applying as per your preference. And in case you wish to prepare for IPM 2022 or 2023 or even for HSWE 2023, feel free to get in touch with us on 93439-21347. That's all. Thank you very much.